Good Monday morning, everyone. Meteorologist Stone Schaefer here with your March 4th one minute forecast. Snow totals from the weekend. Ken Mayer, one of the highest, uh, nine inches. Max Bass, 8.5. Dickinson at 8.5 was sort of the surprise of the weekend uh, as we look at that. But Sherwood, 8.2. Watford City, 8. You had Velva at 6. Williston also at 5, which was probably right about what we expected for them. Uh, some areas I would, wouldn't be surprised a little farther north of Williston got a little bit more than that. And then some other totals around the state. Uh, Minot at 4. Harvey 3.5, Kildare 4.8, Bismarck only seen 0.5. That was enough to create some blowing snow issues that we're going to see throughout much of the morning. Uh, highs today, teens to the uh, mid to lower 30s down to the south. That snowpack should keep you a little bit colder over the next really week or so up to the north. Uh, precision cast shows we're not done with the snow quite yet this week. Nothing extreme, but a noticeable snowfall possible uh, Tuesday and uh, really maybe Tuesday, Wednesday morning. We'll have a second wave Wednesday midday that moves through uh, but should move out and then we start to see a really a calmer pattern uh, towards the end of the week into the weekend with plenty of sunshine and temperatures recovering in most places back to the 40s uh, snow potential for the rest of the week does show that area uh, of snow down Tuesday into Wednesday uh, one to three inches possible the south central south to east portions of the state there could be an additional one to three in areas really from Williston to Mina as well as that second wave moves itself in Wednesday so uh, nothing again nothing extreme for this week but noticeable at times, especially in areas like Bismarck where you didn't get much snow over the weekend. 10-day temperature trends, well that's showing us 20s through about Friday, 30s for Saturday, 40s on Sunday, we'll start next week in the 50s.